talk about in december 2007 darus salam foundation purchased a 6.5 acre parcel of land with plans to build a masjid and academy the construction of the masjid was completed in july 2013 and its doors opened just days before the start of ramadan in 2015 an additional 3.5 acre parcel of land was purchased and the parking lot was expanded with access to swift road making a total of 400 parking spaces in 2017 the parking lot was further expanded to accommodate for the spaces lost to the construction of phase 2 seminary national campus beginning the following year in 2021 construction of the seminary campus was completed providing a much needed facility for the rapid growth of the seminary <laughs> Centrally located on the intersection of I-355 and North Avenue, Darussalam Foundation is easily accessible to around 20 suburbs in which thousands of Muslim families reside by the grace of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. In addition to providing prayer accommodations for brothers and sisters, the vision of Masjid Darussalam is to preserve, implement, and disseminate Islamic knowledge, as well as nurturing and preparing the future leaders through sound traditional understanding and learning. Darussalam is unique in that along with providing a beautiful beautiful sanctuary for worship. It also incorporates a higher educational institute. Masjid Darussalam serves as a community center for residents while Darussalam Seminary offers beginner through advanced classes in various Islamic sciences. The masjid is grateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to have a number of young American-born qualified Islamic scholars in its staff in addition to enjoying the support of many ulama from across the nation. Darussalam's epicenter is a beautiful masjid that provides prayer halls for both men and women. And inspiration one receives from the building's architectural art history is only increased upon entering the sanctuary and experiencing the atmosphere found inside. Along with the five daily prayers, two Friday lectures are regularly conducted in English, followed by an Arabic khutbah. The Friday sermons are powerful, moving, and relevant. Darus Salaam's prayer times can be found at masjidds.org. After daily prayers, there are summaries of important points based on readings from the Prophet's narration, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Through these readings, the worshippers are reminded about the importance of the religion's essentials and inspired to perform good deeds. During most hours, several scholars are present on site, occupied with teaching, writing, speaking, researching, and answering questions. Alhamdulillah, the Phase 2 Seminary Campus Project was completed in 2021, marked by the grand opening held in March. The new 65 thousand square feet seminary building continues with the existing masjid's traditional Ottoman architectural style. With the use of similar cast stone exterior and arches, the new seminary connects to the existing masjid, creating a beautiful outdoor courtyard centered around a fountain where students and attendees can relax and rejuvenate. New entrances to the facility along with 100 new parking spaces further facilitate easy access for congregants. 21 new classrooms have state-of-the-art educational equipment. The code-compliant early childhood program facility is fully furnished. A sunlight-filled 2,000 square feet research library houses more than 25,000 books and computer lab and a conference room with a separate lounge area for eager researchers. New restrooms along with integrated wudu facilities are located on each of the three floors in men's and women's wings. A large octagonal shaped domed women's prayer sanctuary has a capacity for 400 attendees. The women's prayer sanctuary includes an attached child care room separated by a soundproof glass wall providing a full view of the prayer sanctuary. A 6600 square foot NCAA regulation size gymnasium provides opportunities for students and community members to play multiple sports such as basketball, volleyball, indoor soccer and badminton. The gym gym includes a dedicated two-lane indoor running track on the second floor. It also provides space for other large indoor events and presentations. The seminary has separate fitness centers for men and women. There are 2,850 square foot sections in the dining facility, one catering to men and the other to women, each with its own kitchen. The combined dining facility has a capacity to seat 500 people and is rented out as a banquet hall for community events, generating funds for the masjid. 
Masjid Darul Salam has a full service court, compliant funeral facility with a family waiting room for 25 people. A new and large ID server room serves the educational activities of the teachers and students of the seminary. The entire building has a comprehensive security system, including surveillance, alarms, and an automated door locking system. The new seminary building complex includes an open courtyard served with LED lighting for for efficiency and energy conservation. The seminary has a current ICC 500 NSSA code compliant storm shelter within its buildings. Water bottle refill stations are strategically located in the seminary to discourage use of plastic bottles and thus reduce waste. <laughs> After reflecting on the history of American Muslims, it is apparent that Islamic scholarship has arrived on this country's shores in successive waves. The first generation of immigrant Muslims, still strongly tied to their homelands, invited scholars born and educated abroad to teach them in their native languages and help them live their deen harmoniously in the new land. Thereafter, their children, immersed in the American language and culture, called for scholars who could relate to them. So a second wave of scholars, this time American-born Muslims, traveled overseas and acquired the knowledge they needed to serve their generation. Now the time has come to raise up a new wave of learned Muslims who have been born, bred and educated at home. A wave that will duly fill the sacred posts of imams and scholars, address Islamic legal and social issues and challenges unique to the American context, convey with clear expression the true spirit of Islam to our non-Muslim fellow citizens and establish institutions that will be forces of good, both spiritually and intellectually. Darul Salaam Foundation aspires to prepare these future leaders to take on the challenges for generations to come. In the United States, Islam is here to stay. The first generation immigrant Muslims did an immense amount of good work by building masajid in nearly every urban center and establishing other facilities required for us to live a wholesome religious life in this country. The environment we experience here is a result of their pioneering efforts and the amount of appreciation due to them is enormous. May Allah Azzawajal reward them perpetually in this world and the next. A new generation of Muslims is here. Between the children and grandchildren of the first generation and the growing number of reverts, we are witnessing a diverse community of young Muslims desirous and ambitious to build upon the effort of those who preceded them. The challenges and experiences that the future generations will face will be complex. There is a definite need for the new generation to be well versed in Islam and the Quran while also being acquainted with the intricacies of American society. There is a calling for young American scholars who are ready and able to stand up to the challenges of the times. These young scholars are here now and they are ready to commit their time, energy and passion to this task. And for that, they need help. Before today's generation passes on, it is incumbent that they invest in the future of the next. The greatest need of the upcoming generation is education. Darus Salaam opened its seminary program, the Takmil Institute for Higher Islamic Studies, to train the next generation of scholars, both men and women. Takmil is a rigorous seven-year Alamiya degree program that comprehensively imparts a well-designed syllabus that aims to educate the next generation of scholars, lecturers, researchers, thinkers, and academics. The Institute's instructors have dedicated many years of their lives pursuing studies in the Arabic language and the sacred sciences locally as well as abroad at eminent Dar al Alums based on the South Asian pedagogical model and at renewed centers of learning in the Middle East. Our teachers were raised in the United States. In fact, most of them were born here. They are versed in the nuances of American culture and this allows them to easily connect and relate to the student body. Our teachers impart knowledge in a way that makes it applicable and pertinent within the contemporary context of American society without compromising the core principles of our deen. This program is a true beacon of knowledge that will guide our community into the future, inshallah. 
the Tamheed summer program is divided into two three-week courses. The Summer Arabic Essentials course is a comprehensive and concentrated three-week study of the Arabic language. Each summer, enthusiastic students prepare to be significantly challenged in a stimulating language immersion course which focuses extensively on reading, writing, listening, and speaking. The Deen Intensive is a three-week immersion program where students will study essential Islamic studies while spending time in the company of nurturing ulama and other students of the sacred sciences. Every Muslim must know the material covered in these courses. The Tanweer Intensive is a year-long immersion program into the Arabic language and Islamic studies for brothers and sisters, individuals seeking further education and religious literacy, and those making transitions in life from high school to college, from college to the workplace, or from one job to another can benefit greatly from this program. These transitions can be enormous. Along with being physically demanding, they can be emotionally and spiritually taxing. Many of us need an opportunity to refresh ourselves, to find direction and inspiration before embarking on major life decisions. We need Islam in our lives and we need to understand it. We need to enter new phases of life with love for Islam, radiating from within our souls, permeating our thoughts and actions, and opening our hearts to our true purpose. This program is a great opportunity for one to immerse oneself into sacred knowledge, to realize and learn one's religion while being present in an environment where Islam is practiced out of love. For a full year, one will learn Arabic and the Islamic sciences in a way that will change them forever. The Tadris program offers an accredited high school education through American school alongside a core education of Arabic and Islamic studies. The program consists of a comprehensive high school curriculum taught by qualified teachers imparting a dynamic syllabus through modern didactic resources. Here, students receive within the confines of an Islamic environment instruction in core subjects such as algebra, geometry, biology, chemistry, and the language arts. The program aims to produce individuals who can handle the workload of the most challenging university programs. Graduates will receive a high school diploma and will take ACT TSAT tests. The program endeavors to prepare students for their college applications and aspirations. Exceptional grades and high SAT scores are a crucial part of that. Darussalam Salaam takes the future and success of students seriously. Tremendous effort is made to help those enrolled in the program transition into college and succeed in their studies thereafter. The high school portion of the Tadris program is not offered separately. It is a program which integrates high school education with the foundational Arabic and Islamic studies courses offered by the Tanweer Intensive and Takmil Institute. The Tahfiz Academy for Quran Memorization and Recitation. Darussalam offers a comprehensive Quran memorization program for boys and girls with dedicated male and female staff. Along with striving to produce strong hufaz, the academy prepares students to become moral citizens and productive members of society. Who embody the teachings of the Holy Quran. A unique feature of the Tahfiz Academy is that Darussalam provides foundational Islamic studies that are incorporated into the program. Hadith, Fiqh, Sirah, and the prophetic supplications are taught by scholars every day alongside memorizing the Quran. Moreover, to ensure the Hiv students do not fall behind in their secular studies, Darussalam has developed its own unique lamp, language arts and math program. Alhamdulillah, the Hiv's graduates have excelled when they returned back to school. The Tajweed and Tarbiya After School Program In this program, children learn how to properly recite the Quran alongside learning Islam's basic teachings. It is an ideal opportunity for school-going children to learn the Quran. This is a Nazira program joined with Islamic studies in a wholesome environment. The Tafheem Weekend Islamic Studies Program is a flexible four-year course covering 24 diverse subjects aimed at individuals who want to gain a deep understanding of the foundations of their faith but are unable to do so on a full-time basis. Classes are held on Saturdays and Sundays from 10 a.m. to 1.15 p.m. 
Team Fajr began immediately after Ramadan 2017 and it is an ongoing success, alhamdulillah. Brothers of all ages come from all over Chicago land together every Saturday morning at Masjid Darus Salaam. Firstly, the Fajr prayer is performed in congregation followed by prophetic invocations. Thereafter, there is a short discourse from Imam Ghazali's Ihya Ulum al Din until sunrise. Finally, after performing the Ishraq prayer, everyone enjoys a delectable breakfast together. Alhamdulillah, over 100 attendees participate weekly. Throughout this program, Darus Salaam hopes to rejuvenate the Iman of the attendees and foster bonds of brotherhood that will be a positive force for righteousness and virtue. Each month, local and visiting speakers conduct seminars and workshops that address a wide variety of topics, including challenges faced by today's Muslims. Previous seminars are available online at masjiddarussalam.org. Current seminars are live-streamed on Darussalam's website. Ramadan is a blessed month full of fasting, Qur'an, and devout worship. At Darussalam, qualified scholars who have thoroughly memorized the entire Qur'an lead the nightly taraweeh prayer, and during the last 10 days, a round-the-clock itikaf program takes place. This includes tajweed, workshops, daily tafsir classes in which the Qur'an from that evening's taraweeh is explained, question and answer sessions, classes exclusively for women, youth programs, dhikr, dua, salawat, pre-fast meals in the morning, dates and other delicacies to break the fast and dinner. Annually, Darus Salaam hosts a three-day retreat that brings the community together. The program consists of lectures delivered by scholars from all over the country, question and answer sessions, Quranic recitation, Islamic poetry, and interactive workshops. All meals are provided on site, and itikaf arrangements are made for those who want to spend the weekend at the masjid. Other programs at Darus Salaam include the Bukhari Khatam, which is a commencement ceremony for the Takmil 7-year Alamiya program, annual Qur'an night, an evening of Qur'an recitation with the renowned Qur'a and Munshideen, the Sira conference covering a different aspect of our beloved Prophet Wasallam's life each year, annual benefit dinner, an opportunity to share what the community has, has accomplished together. The Winter Intensive, a three-day academic intensive with brothers, sisters, youth, and kids program. The seminary currently has approximately 500 students, 55 dedicated full-time and part-time instructors, over 100 full-time employees, a combined 355 hours of classroom instruction per week. Nearly one-third of the entire student body receives full or partial financial aid from Darus Salaam, including daily meals and living accommodations that amounts to more than $400,000 annually. By supporting the seminary, it means that you're supporting the future of Islamic scholarship in America. You take a share for everyone who benefits from the ulama Darus Salaam produces. You can also give zakah towards the tuition of eligible students. You can donate directly to Masjid Darus Salaam at masjiddds.org slash donate. <laughs>